What if you could make more saleable paper? What if your machines ran more efficiently and lasted longer? What if you could achieve an optimal blend and spend less energy? Let me put this a little bit more simply. What if you could predict good paper here instead of making bad paper here? Well, with the Tico Drainac, you can. The Drainac is the only Freenus analyzer available today that will help you visualize, understand, and execute without wasted time or wasted money. Sounds pretty good, right? The Drainac is the answer to your pain. It's the fastest, lowest cost, and most pain-free device of its kind available in the world today, and frankly, it's awesome. With this simple, low-cost instrument, you will revolutionize your process and realize a return on your investment so quickly, you'll wonder why you didn't make this decision years ago. So, what's your freeness? Do you know? More importantly, do you know what impact variable freeness has on your process each and every day? Put another way, do you know how much variable freeness is actually costing you? We operate on a simple principle. If you can see something, you can manage it. That's the visualize, understand, and execute we started with earlier. The Drain Act will help you make more saleable paper, improve mach machine efficiency and performance, and help you optimize the energy you're putting into your stock. So now you've heard the pitch, let's talk about the details. Drainac has many applications in facilities like yours. For example, some people use it to monitor freeness and perhaps close the loop on refiner control. Others use it for enhancing machine runnability and managing pulp blends. There are two components to a Drainac, the analysis riser and the electronics enclosure. <coughs> this is the analysis riser. It's the component that samples your stock and performs the freeness analyses. This is the Drainac control enclosure. It houses the various electronics and pneumatic packages. Unlike other analyzers, Drainac doesn't try to automate the TAPI 227 CSF methodology. Instead, we use a proprietary technique that allows us to complete an analysis in as little as 12 seconds. We start by creating a pressure differential in the analysis chamber, which forces stock up into the riser. That stock hits a screen which forms a fiber pad and then only filtrate enters the analysis chamber. We measure the amount of time it takes that filtrate to fill a specific volume. If we were to plot the height of filtrate in the riser as a function of time, this is what it would look like. Stock rises quickly at first because there's nothing to impede it. When it hits the screen, the fiber pad begins to form and the response slows down. You'll know that the response isn't linear first. This is mostly due to variable consistency and it's also the reason we don't start measuring the filtrate right away. Now after the pad forms, the response steadies down and becomes largely linear. We measure the time the filtrate takes to fill the volume between the two probes and that's how we get our drain time analyses. Let's talk about maintenance. Unlike our competitors, there are no moving parts to the drain act, so it's very easy to maintain. First, you'll need to keep it clean, which mostly means keeping the main screen and the analysis probes clean and free of debris. How often you'll need to do this will depend on your stock, but most customers typically clean their systems two to three times a week. About once a year, you'll need to replace certain consumables in the system. Now, the Drain Act isn't the only way to measure freeness out there, but it frankly blows the alternatives out of the water. There's lab testing, but as you already know, that's slow and highly variable. You've got TAPI-227 robots, um, but they're also slow, and they're very expensive. And because they're robots, they're complicated, and that means that they're expensive to maintain. Of course, you could skip testing altogether, but that's not good. If you can't see it, you can't control it. Drainac is the only device that will allow you to visualize, understand, and execute without wasted money or wasted time. Let's wrap this up. The drain act is simple, and really, so is a choice. Visualize, understand, execute. See the problem, understand it, and then you can plan a solution, all with drain act.